The Life Assays Vet Reader is a Life Assays product for veterinary medicine. This demonstration video provides essential information for users regarding system handling and operation. On the back side of the instrument, you will find the on-off switch and an RS-232 input for connecting the vet reader to an external computer or printer. On the right side of the instrument, you will find a slot for the disposable algorithm chip. This chip is provided with each reagent test kit. On the front of the instrument is located the internal coil for inserting the reagent vial and the LCD's display for instruction and measurement display only. Place the instrument freestanding on a level surface. The required ambient temperature is between 18 and 25 degrees Celsius. Avoid direct lights, fans, and dirt. Insert the disposable algorithm chip provided with the Life Assays test kit and turn on the vet reader using the on-off switch on the back side of the instrument. The instrument performs a reagent chip control and displays weight 113 and starts a numerical countdown from 113. Once the instrument has counted down to zero, the instrument will undergo a stabilization process for a maximum period of 20 minutes. The instrument display will show during this time STAB T. Once stabilization is complete, the instrument is ready for use and will display K9 CRP test 20, where 20 indicates the number of measurements left on the chip and K9 CRP test indicates the life assays reagent kit name. To start a measurement, press and hold the enter button. The instrument will display weight, followed by insert vial. Load a reagent vial into the vet reader. The instrument will display weight 5 and count down 5 seconds before displaying collect and add sample. As long as the vial remains loaded in the instrument and collect and add sample is displayed, the user has plenty of time to collect the sample. Collect a 5 microliter serum or plasma sample using the glass capillary provided with the reagent kit. Be sure to use the capillary holder for capillary handling and not your fingers. For accurate results, avoid the introduction of air bubbles into the glass capillary and be sure to fill the entire length of the capillary with serum or plasma. Excess sample on the outside of the capillary can be removed by carefully wiping off the excess with a clean tissue. Unload the reagent vial from the vet reader. The user now has five seconds to open the cap, drop the capillary into the reagent vial, and close the cap. The display will automatically switch to vortexing mode, showing Vortex 30. Vortex the reagent vial for 30 seconds using the timer on the display. Once the countdown has reached zero, the instrument will display Vortex OK. Insert vial 10 will be displayed on the vet reader and a countdown starts from 10 seconds. You may turn the reagent vial upside down and make sure there is no pellet in the bottom of the vial. Load the reagent vial back into the vet reader Please note that the reagent vial must be loaded back within these 10 seconds. If not, the measurement is aborted and the reagent chip will count down one measurement and the user loses one test. Once the reagent vial has been loaded back into the instrument, the display will show weight 660 and the instrument will count down from 660 seconds or 11 minutes. At this time, the user is free to leave the instrument. 
After the 11 minute countdown, the instrument will automatically perform a measurement by moving the reagent vial in and out of the internal coil five times. The measurement result is shown on the display in milligrams per liter and will remain on the display until the reagent vial is unloaded from the instrument. Once the reagent vial is unloaded from the instrument, the display on the instrument will show K9 CRP test 19, where 19 indicates the number of tests left on the chip. Start the measurement by pressing and holding the enter button. Once instructed by the display, load the reagent vial. Collect your sample using a glass capillary provided in the reagent kit and a capillary holder. Unload the reagent vial from the instrument, open the reagent cap and drop the glass capillary into the reagent vial. Once unloading the reagent vial, the instrument will switch automatically to Vortex Countdown after 5 seconds. Vortex the reagent vial for 30 seconds. After the vortexing time has run out, the display shows Insert Vial 10. This means the user has 10 seconds to control the pellet is completely suspended and then load the reagent vial back into the instrument. The user may now leave the instrument. The measurement will be performed and the result displayed after 11 minutes. Lastly, unload the reagent vial from the instrument and dispose of it properly. The instrument is now ready for a new measurement. For more information regarding Life Assay's veterinary products, please refer to the Vet Reader Manual or the instructions for use leaflet provided with the reagent kit. Thank you for choosing Life Assays.